make the cabinet sauce, uh, homemade cabinet sauce, uh, the carrot peels, and onion, and cilantro, the head of the salad. sauce uh, 400 milliliter me and parents just uh, two teaspoon two ketchups uh, total is uh, 2.5 liters which is a sauce three teaspoon uh, two teaspoons of salt and uh, two and a half cups of sugar so nearly uh, one liter of the stock so after all to you know it comes out to one liter, one liter of stock and we pour it back to the pot. So it's a two and a half cups of uh, sugar. HP sauce, 400 ml. Two teaspoon of meal uh, perry. Salt, two teaspoon. Two of the uh, ketchup. It's a uh, two point five liter. And this kind of sauce can use a lot of. Uh, uh, dish. Besides uh, pork chop, like uh, the prawns and uh, spare rib, and then we let it boil and simmer it for a bit, and we done. And uh, this kind of sauce, after done, it can be kept in the cooler for a long, long time. Stir it, stir it up, and make sure it's all dissolved well. So we wait until it boils up, and then we turn it down to low, lowest to let it uh, simmer, and let the sauce be a bit thicker. So this kind of sauce you don't have need to get on start to thicken it up when you cook. Just a little amount dishes you need, and tastes very really good with you cook it with shelled prawns or uh, uh, jumbo prawns. I start to boil it now. So we uh, get it to the lowest heat and let it simmer in. for about uh, 20 minutes. That will be good. In time, in time, you just stir it. Now, oh, it's really good. The time that uh, we can uh, shut off the uh, so after it cool off, it will get much uh, thicker and more consistent. But don't cover it. <laughs> 